Our topic today, the exaltation power of favor. Scriptural reference, Psalms 89, 10-20. Memory verse, for thou art the glory of their strength, and in thy favor our horn shall be exalted. Psalms 89, 17 KJV. In this account David uses words to describe the promotion of God in his life. He looked back and realized that God was the reason behind his strange lifting. Here he makes a connection between glory and strength thou art the glory of their strength. Glory is usually the external manifestation of success, victory, prosperity and abundance. While glory is an external force, strength is an internal force. Strength is an unseen virtue that determines glory. It is an inbuilt force that brings glory. The absence of strength within, limits glory without. It takes divine strength within to manifest glory without. Anytime you're winning outside, it is the strength of God within that is responsible for this. David finally connects the third virtue, favor. He says, in thy favor our horn shall be exalted. Favor here becomes a powerful destiny asset. David realizes that without the favor of God, his horn will be cut off. Anywhere horn is being mentioned in the scriptures, it talks of unusual strength. Psalms 92, 10, Psalms 30, 7. The wild bull, elephant and ram all have their strength domiciled in their horns. To lack strength is to be hornless, and to be hornless is to be without glory. Action points for today. 1. Reach out for divine strength in everything. 2. Stay in divine presence to build internal strength. 3. Apply for the favor of God often. 4. Surrender your weakness unto God. 5. Thank God always for every success glory and achievement. Quote for today, the absence of strength within, limits glory without. It takes divine strength within to manifest glory without. To lack strength is to be hornless, and to be hornless is to be without glory. Prayers 1. O Lord, I thank you for another day like this. Glory be to your holy name. 2. Holy Spirit, Increase my inner strength and cause my life to manifest your supernatural glory. Today, I reach out for you that makes great in Jesus' mighty name.